and you are alone, you are. Not today, you are not going to be here. Oh, you are not here. Oh, you are not here. Oh, you are not here. Do I know you? I just a good Samaritan. I like to help people around here. What's here? Come on, babe. He's a good looking guy, but you didn't mention that one. A common area boy, Abdero. And all you can see is his good looks. He is driving me crazy. Wow. It's what I believe. What's up here? You did a fire. Report to the police. Hey, what are you doing? Hey, people like you. Hey, you want it? Okay. I didn't know I would be with you this soon. Even when I was in my face playing the moonlight dance, I was just knew that my one and only Amma is not there. And I'll be doing this. Hmm. 12 months. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Is that a 12, Amara? Even when I'm playing with my face, just in the middle of the play, I just knew that my Amma is not there. And I'll be doing this. Hmm. Liar. So you want me to believe that you've not been looking at other movies in the moonlight? Hey. Come on, Amara. How can I? I can't do that kind of thing to you, no. You know you're my one and only. Eh? I mean, mm? I can't do that to you. I understand. Mm. But let's not go there. You know I'm not clean. Mm. I forgot. I forgot to see you. I was just trying to meet the thing and the fact that you're not so clean, my lord. Could you please excuse me? Let me go and ease off a bit. Eh? Please, no. Mm. Not fall without the F knowing. That abomination. That abomination. That abomination. I'm I don't be scared. See, 
爆下来。我， why you looking at me like that as if you've seen a ghost? Amara, where are your beads? Oh, I forgot them in the river. And why do you ask? Amara, did you go to the two river? Of course I did. I felt like washing myself. And why do you ask? Amara, you went to the two river? Yes, I did. Hi! Amara! What is it now? Amara, what have you done? How could you? Why did you go to the two river? Oh! So what are you talking about? What have I done? What? What did I do? Because of Amara! Amara! Amara, you killed me! Amara! What did I do now? So what are you saying? <laughs> so you're getting me scared. Amara! What is it now? Amara, you went to the two river. Yes, I did! Hi! Amara! Uzo, stop this. What did I do? What have I done? Amma, you've killed me. You've killed me. Uzo. Uzo, why? Amma. Amma. There's great danger in the village. Great danger. Amma, can't you see? Can't you see the injury? Can't you see how everybody is dying unnecessarily? So, I don't understand what you're saying. The part you had yesterday at the Itu River. Okay. It was a taboo. I was too tongue tied and shocked that I couldn't tell you. Hey, Uzo. Amara. How do you mean? Amara. Amara, see, the honest truth is that no woman or lady see your cleanliness is better than the Itu River. Mm -hmm. And you will see your cleanliness. Hey, Uzo. Why didn't you tell me? Amara. Amara. So I think triggers of calamity almost our people. That's why everything is happening. Mm. And I'm sure the OJ meeting that your father had gone to at the King's Palace. It was not ordinary, Amara. Mm. So Amara. Mm. Okay. 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 I'm scared of you. Don't worry, okay? Just get get your thing. Just get your things and I'll let it go. Don't worry. Don't worry. Just get your things. Just get your things. Strange and sad moments as we bury our dead and count our losses. But it is said that the snake seen by one man comes to a pipe. We have all seen that snake, and together we shall chase it out of our community. Will you keep quiet and listen to me? Meanwhile, 
the cause of the woes of people have been discovered. And according to the oracle, a maiden went to the river, into the river, to take her bath in her state of uncleanliness. But I promise you, before this evening, my chiefs and I will commune with the oracle priest to find out what must be done. You are spoken well, Highness. <laughs> what is happening in this village? <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> I greet you. The great Nkuma. Having of justice, the eye of the gods, I welcome you. We know you bring tidings from the land of the gods. Speak, for our ears are itching to know what must be done. He that has a hand that cannot rub the back must rub the stomach. Mm -hmm. My great king, my chiefs, the land mourns for the sacrilege committed by a maiden, and according to the gods, she has left the shores of our community. The great Nkuma. Do the gods not know the name of this very maiden? <laughs> Let them tell us so that we can fish her out wherever she must have run to and then do to her according to the wish of the gods. Huh? Let them tell us. Itu! The great god of the river has told me that it has no pleasure in the blood of a culprit, for she is unclean. But as it is customary, a peculiar sacrifice must be offered to it too. Wise one, what then does it want? Good question. Mm -hmm. To cleanse the land. And appease the raging spirit of Itu, the god of the river. Four able bodied men must be sacrificed at our holy square. Seven days! Seven days from now! <coughs> then, only then, shall the land of Obole be sanctified. Well, my chiefs, we heard the demand of the gods. What do you think? Great me. We do not have any choice than to do what the oracle says. But remember, if we have to do the wish of Itu, the god of the river, then who will bring the human head for the sacrifice? That's the question. Will you? Will you get it? That's the problem we have now. Jesus, you listen to me. Our people have suffered so greatly. There will be no more shedding of blood. Um, in that case, 
let's send some of our warriors to the neighboring communities to scout for the human sacrifices. Let us send them. Good idea. My prince, I'm worried. You have not told me where you are going to. And you don't even want your mother and your father to know your activities these days. My prince, is everything okay? There's nothing wrong, my future queen. It's just that I have this personal assignment to complete. What kind of assignment is that? That you don't even want to tell me about? Um... Ada... I shall tell you everything when I come back. Hmm? Just keep this movement a secret, okay? I'm scared, my friends. Don't be scared. Shall return to you. My future queen, safely and in peace. Don't be scared, eh? Just be careful, my prince. My chief. Only one. Two, three days from now, and our land shall be rid of all the calamities that have been tormenting our people. Your Highness, I thought the gods would have chosen a shorter day for the sacrifice. Why? Why do you think so? Ibe. Ibe. You are talking like a proverbial turtle who had been inside a dunk pit for months on the day he was to be released he started complaining about the stench of the dunk why didn't you say this earlier eh Ibe but Ibe on a serious note why do you think that seven days it's too long. Remember, some necessary rites have to be performed before the sacrifice. Exactly. I know. It is just that I have been having this dream where I saw four chickens playing in an open field. Suddenly the ground opened and swallowed three out of the four. The fourth one ran into a distance. This worries me on account of those men because I've been having this dream for three consecutive nights in other words you think that something could happen to the three if not the four captives exactly yes. your highness a case dream is just coincidental coincidental? yes nothing can possible happen to our captives Except there is going to be an invasion from an enemy village. Invasion from our neighboring towns. Which I do not foresee. Huh? Okay. Do you have something else to say? Well, it's just a feeling. That's all. But I pray that nothing of sort happens. Just a feeling. Yes, of course. I know we all have our feelings. Rubbish are both of you talking. Eh? That a man visited you and gave you wine. And what happened? Your Highness, 
since one of the is missing perhaps one of these two should be used as a replacement your highness we are just shouting and backing over what should have been avoided if my money signal was taken into consideration just let this thing not bring this kingdom into serious deep and uh, worse crisis Huh? May God Great King of Obolo. The eye of the God. I greet you. May you live long. The eye of the gods. What do they say this time? Great King. It has not rejected the sacrifice. Only the carelessness of two warriors and a young maiden. And the consequence shall be borne by the royal house. Eh? How do you mean? It holds you, your highness, responsible for the loss of its sacrifices. But it has gone ahead with the sacrifice. And the royal house shall bear the consequences of the loss. May you live long. Can you imagine that? My own royal house is being held responsible for these failures. Now both of you tell me why you should not be slaughtered. Get up, get up, get up, stand here. Stand here. Stand here, stand here. Please, 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 I'm sorry. Everything has been changed. Even the, the whole thing, having two people being in the palace. Look how the, the new king has changed everything. Not even the palace, my dear. Not even the palace. Look at the way our girls, the maid, look at the way they dress. They dress good. Even our prince. Look at the way he dress. I'm even suspecting all those girls. Those girls, they will be chasing the prince very soon. Not even that. If you people look at the warriors, look at how they are standing. Well said. Look at the farm. Look at the grass. I'm even thinking that I'll go and join the warriors. You're right, you're right, you're right. Look at the way they are standing. Look at the way they are standing. So, are you going to the house? Um, I was about to go to the house. Okay. 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 Ndo, Ndo, Ogu, how are you? How is the family? I hope you are preparing well for the festival, the dance. Everything is well prepared. Okay, okay. So, where are you going to? I was coming to your house. My house? Yeah. 
Okay. Um, any problem? There's no problem. Okay. Iko have been killing inside over a guy that did not love him. Did he again? When will Iko stop doing these things to himself? Eh? So what do we do now? I think we meet an astronaut and talk to him. That's a very good idea. Yeah. So where are we? Are we going now? No, no, we go next. So maybe next time you just come to my house and see me. Let me go to the and see Ukele. Thank you. Take care of yourself. Royal Highness has asked to see you in his chamber at once. Tell him I'm not feeling too well to come and see him. I shall tell him that. My Queen. makes you feel like sound. What is it and why are you crying? My king, you know it's been two years since after the birth and death of our child. Since then I've not been able to conceive and bear you another child. My queen, children comes from the gods. You don't understand me, my king. You know, as a king, the whole village expects you to have a child. Something that will benefit you to your status. So, what if I don't have a child yet? Will it make me a lesser king? You don't understand, my king. You know you will be celebrating the Aji festival and you hope to, to choose a maiden and you know what that means my queen i understand your fears but like i told you already i am not a guilty bear hmm? and then um, you are my one and only queen and there will be no other queen apart from me. So cry no more. Hmm? Thank you, my king. Oh, no. Thank you very much. I'm a little young one. Cry no more. Hmm? Igbo! Igbo! Igbo, why are you sitting down there like a pregnant woman? Eh? I've been waiting for you all morning like we, like we planned. So that we can go to the farm from my house. Don't think we are still thinking of, of that indeed of a girl. I can't stop to think about that indeed. I love her very well. To what still the only issue? Her mother is not helping matters at all. She's not helping. Hmm. My friend, take my advice. Take my advice. That girl is not good for you. She's too ambitious for my liking. The, 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 the same goes to um, Ipele, her mother. What Oku is saying is very correct. 
Mugigi don't love you. So you better forget about her. But you know I love her. That is your own wow. headache. That is your own headache. I have told you my mind. Ndu has told you his mind. Igbo, mm. mm. won't you go with us? Are you coming or are you going to keep sitting down there? Taking on somebody that doesn't even know you exist. We are going to the farm. You have a very good dancing step. Thank you, Ne. You took after me. I was a good dancer in my olden days. Even now, I still dance very well. And your father was a good dancer too. Ne, was that the attraction that brought you two together? <laughs> I want you to ask that question again. Your father was a good dancer, as I said. So, my aim was to become the, the queen of our community in those days. But your father was so lucky, just captured me because I could remember how I performed during the Aju festival. The prince just, you know, he was like, you know, carrying me home. But the reverse is the case. Ne, not to worry, that which you are not able to achieve, I indeed shall achieve it. Ne, very soon, you shall become a big monster. <laughs> I will sing for you. Yes, yes, Look at my step. Oju go wa fo na wa le se mu no ye ga gbe gbu ni ni jere mu e duwe o jere ae ne you know how to dance watch me okay so you like it yes ne if you could dance that like that you are the king's wife already and i'm happy you should be happy so that's all that i'll sing for you okay ne so can you dance more yes ne are you not one of the maidens that dance at the last of the festival? Your Highness, I was one of them. I must confess, your dance step really captivated me. Thank you, Your Highness. I never knew a maiden could dance so well like that. Thank you, Your Highness. I feel very honored to know that you love my dancing steps. Yes, I do. Keep it on. Today. And he said he loved my dancing step. In fact, I can see myself at the palace already. <laughs> now that King Ike has started admiring your, your, your dancing step, you have to put more boost to your elbow. Get prepared for the next festival. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and before you know it, me, I will become a cantor to the Queen of Other Kingdom. <laughs> I shall give the king his most desired and much rated head to the throne. <laughs> Say that again. And I will and not wait to become the grandmother of the prince of Obodo. <laughs> hey, I'm happy. Oh. Are you not happy? Mama, I'm happy. I'll be nice food please, he's hungry. Now nah, you will eat your food though. Yes, <laughs> ma'am. My queen, your meal is ready. Alright, go and take yours. 
and make sure you keep mine. All right, my friend. My daughter. Yes, ma'am. Listen to me. Nobody will blame the king for wanting to, ma to marry a maiden as a second wife. Huh, Mama. That is why I seek for your advice. <sighs> My queen, His Royal Highness seek for your presence at the palace and he has asked you to come with me at once. As you can see, I'm discussing with my mother. Tell him that I will be in the palace as soon as possible. You may go. Yes, my queen. Mama, why are you staring at him like that? Just considering something. Considering what, Mama? How close is him to your husband? I don't know. All I know is that he's, he is very close to my husband, more than the rest guards. And he seems to be following you everywhere you go. Yes. And that is because my husband believed that with him around me, I'm well protected. How close are you to him? Ah, Mama, why all these questions? Why? My daughter, it is rather risky or delicate for a queen of this land to lay with a male subject for your quest for a child. Oh, Mama. I wonder if you are the one saying all this. Mm. I'm beginning to see that you're beginning to reason very well. And thank the gods for that. better for you to use a slave under your control. Mama, what are you insinuating? What I mean is that for you to use a slave under your control so that nobody will find out. Find out what, Mama? Are you saying that I, the Queen of Oboli Land, should go and lay with a male guide all in search of a child? Ha, Mama, I never knew you could be this shameless. I'm going and I will not come back here again. My daughter, don't ever come crying to me. A stubborn fly that refuses to listen follows the corpse to the grave. my king, but I was wondering if my king would permit me to give a word of advice. Word of advice? On what? 
my king. If there is any woman in this life that I owe my life to, it is you, my king. Therefore, it is very important that I protect your interest. Perhaps my king should take a maiden who will give him a chance. It pains me that my king does not have a heir to the throne. And I fear the worst. What if something happens to my king? What if something happens to you? God forbid. Your Highness. I, I think I have taken your word of advice. I can go on. Yes, Your Highness. My love, in the ma. How can you deny me this last minute? Oh, I've forgotten the things we once told each other the first time. But then, I wasn't prepared. I was too naive. But now I know what I want. Iko, we are not meant for each other. Please go. You are not meant for each other. Mm. This is because of your ambition to have King Iki attention at the Fort Comanche Festival. Don't even pretend. I know it all. Look, it's okay. You guys will choose you. Eh? I rather lose my manhood. Then you will lose the manhood. Sent for you. Sit down. Thank you, my lord. I have someone here for us to rub minds together as man and wife. Concerning our situation on ground presently, what do you think we should do in this circumstance? My lord, if I had known what to do all this while, I could have done so. But right now, I'm helpless. Tell me, how would you feel if I bring in a second wife? No fully well. As a king in this kingdom, one of the things that I expected of me is to have a heir to the throne. How would you feel? My lord, it's untraditional that you have as many wives as possible. But the situation at hand now is unsolvable. After all, I'm not barren. I once had a child. All I need is a chance for me to prove my womanhood just once again. Must we keep on waiting for this chance indefinitely? Must we? Hmm? In as much as the gods lives, I know they are not sleeping. Woman, the next Aji festival is coming up soon. Four moons is enough for you to prove your womanhood. Else, I might pick another wife for myself. My girl. Yes, 
Thank you. Huh? You will teach me the dance steps which he executed the other day at the village square. Did you see the way the other maidens? They were looking and nodding their heads, <laughs> especially when it came to your turn to dance. You will teach me where he learned that dance step. Hmm. It is a dance of great queens. But don't worry, I will teach you after this day at the festival. Hmm. It is the Huh? And the festival is still far now. Huh? Why wait till after the festival? Because it is my greatest weapon to catch the king's attention. Come this year at the maiden dance. Mm. <laughs> that is why I got the other maidens moping. So that they will know that this year festival is very important to me. Hey, <laughs> my friend. Huh? Wait, you're right. But remember that when you become the queen i ukoleka would like to be your lady in the way to know don't worry my friend <laughs> i will even make you the royal advisor at the palace when the time comes don't worry oh may the god be praised <laughs> i can't wait i can't wait to see that day my friend oh, that worry. is why i call you my friend <laughs> my friend please hurry up hey, time is going You. Yes, my queen. Go and get me your bossy. Alright, my queen. And you. Yes, my queen. Go to the kitchen and prepare me something to eat. Okay. Before I say about that. Where do I start from? What do I tell him? How do I seduce him? My queen, you sent for me. Yes, Obosi. You can sit down. I'm, I'm very sorry to disappoint you, my queen, but it is not in the place of um, slaves to sit in the presence of royalties. Obosi, how will you feel? If you find out that your king cannot father a child. Um, um, my queen, that's a bad thing to happen to a good king like your highness, but the solution lies in the hands of the gods. But do you know that the gods can pass through people like you? To save people like us? Um, my queen, in spite of my loyalty, my service and my allegiance to you still does not guarantee the fact that I want to defy my king's royal dead. He saved my life. I owe him my life. And so I would do anything in my power to protect his interest. My queen. Obosi, are you turning down my offer? Do you know that you can pay for this? Obosi, now get out. Thank you, my queen. Oh, God. Why did I allow myself to be humiliated by this slave? I shouldn't have listened to my mother. Past three days now, I've noticed your reluctance. Each time I send you to my queen. Last night, you avoided it. Instead, directed a maid to our chambers. Now, tell me, why is it so? I'm very sorry, Your Highness. 
But the queen personally ordered me not to come to her again. Why would my queen give such an order? I wouldn't know your highness. Why didn't you tell me this all this while? Your Highness, I didn't want to incur the wrath of the Queen for reporting her to you. I see. Remember to call my mind to eat whenever she returns from her travel. Yes, Your Highness. Mama, how could I have made a fool of myself? You should have seen the shame and the humiliation that that servant gave to me. Mama, Mama, am I not beautiful? Queen of Oboli Land, for a mere servant to turn my offer down? Ah, Mama, I shouldn't have yielded to your advice. My daughter, it's never wise to give up on a venture so easily, especially when the venture, when a price of the venture is worth the trial. So, Mama, what do I do? What do I do? <sighs> My daughter. Mama, just tell me what to do. Mama, how do I do it? Ah, ah Mama. Igbo. Igbo. You know I love you. If I can't do this to me, please. If I love who loves you, I live who doesn't love you. If please, I beg you, I love you. Ipo. If I can't do this to me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. God forbid. Don't do that. Get up. I love you. You know I'm in love with someone else. I'm in love with Indidi. I cannot. You. Ipo, but I love you. I can't. I can't. Ipo, please, I please, you, please, 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 please. I don't love you. Ipo, please, Ipo, no. Ipo, please, don't go. What's up, my lad? I love you, Ipo. Ipo, why? Ipo, why me? Why do I keep thinking about this girl? I've tried getting over her spell, but I can't. I keep seeing her every day, even in my dreams. But I cannot afford to go against the promise I've made to my queen, Ada. She's my only queen and she remains so. But come to think of it, am I not making a mistake? A king like me should have at least a child. What if something happens to me? Ah, but God forbid it. Maybe I should consult the oracle and find out why Ada has not been able to conceive for two years now, after the death of my first child. Yes, that's what I'll do.
Well, that one could be one. Wise one. I went to your shrine, but you were not there. So I decided to come to your house. <laughs> You're welcome, Your Majesty. I know why you are here. And I know the solution to your problem. <laughs> The problem you have brought to me is very easy. Your Majesty, come close to me. Open your bank. Have this. You cannot go with it. That sometimes will be rough on your face, on the dark, in your room. Then in the daytime, put a little in his food. All will be well. Thank you, wise one. Mm. I will come back and show appreciation. Mm. <laughs> Yes, I learned it's your turn to cook for the Royal Highness today. Yes, my queen. And have you done that? No, my queen, I was about to. Don't bother about that. I will do the cooking myself. But my queen? You don't need to ask questions. Your queen has her reason for preparing the meal tonight, okay? Okay, my queen. Will that be all for now? You may go and get the ingredients ready. Yes, my queen. My queen, my highness would like to see you in the palace at once. And do you know why he wants to see me? Not at all, my queen. <sighs> all right. Tell him I'm right behind you. Okay, my queen. I 
Because.